Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Homeopathic Remedies Tutorial. Today I have come up with a new drug which is a very good for a renal calculi. The drug which I am talking about is Sarsa Parila. So before we jump into its indication, let's see first what are kidney stones. Kidney stones or a renal calculi are solid masses made of crystals. Kidney stones usually originate in your kidneys. However, they can develop anywhere along your urinary tract which consists of these parts. Kidneys, ureter, bladder, urethra. The kidneys are vital organs that filters blood and help urine formation. Ureters are tubes that carry urine from the kidney to the urinary bladder. The urinary bladder is a sac that acts like a reservoir for holding urine until it is voided outside the body through urethra. The urethra is the lower part of the urinary system through which urine seeks its path outside the body from the urinary bladder. Stones affect more men than women. The causes include decreased water intake, increased intake of protein, calcium, sodium, sugar or urinary tract infection. Diet rich in oxalates such as spinach, tomato, cabbage, coffee, chocolates, tea, blackberries, strawberries, beetroot and nuts also predispose a person to kidney stones. Excessive vitamin C and vitamin D and uric acid also increase the risk of kidney stone formation. Familial disposition is also a factor in developing kidney stone. Now let's see what are the symptoms of kidney stones. The kidney stones may lie silently in the kidney without any symptom. Severe pain with associated symptoms appear when the stone tries to enter the ureter from the kidney or from the ureter into the bladder or when it tries to pass down from the urinary bladder to the urethra. The pain caused by kidney stones is felt in the flanks that is outer side of the lower abdomen, lower back and often extends to the groin area that is area where abdomen and thighs join or genitals. The urine may contain blood or pus. Painful urination or urgency to urinate may also be present. Nausea and vomiting is yet another symptom associated with kidney pain. Now let's talk about scope of homeopathy and kidney stones. Homeopathic medicines for kidney stones are dual action remedies which are natural and safe. First, they help to remove the stone present in the urinary tract either by crushing them into fine sand like particles or in a few cases in the intact state. Secondly, they hold the promise of removing the tendency towards stone formation in the future. While selecting the appropriate homeopathic medicine for kidney stones, the side affinity is considered along with the pain and associated symptoms. The color of sand particles and urine helps to further refine the search. Although kidney stones can be safely handled with properly selected homeopathic medicine, care should be taken when the size of the stone is very large and it gets impacted in the ureter leading to hydronephrosis that calls for surgical intervention to prevent kidney damage. Moving on to the drug Sarsa Parila. Sarsa Parila drug is considered best homeopathic medicine for kidney stone of the right side. Other drugs include Lycoporium and Noxvomica. Moving on to guiding symptoms of Sarsa Parila. So first, it is a right-sided remedy. Other drugs include Lycoporium, Noxvomica. There is severe unbearable pain at the conclusion of urination just as urine stops to flow. Other drugs include Barbaris vulgaris, Medurinum, Thuja. There is also inability to pass urine freely except in the standing position. Passage of white sand in urine is very characteristic of this drug. 
red sand in urine is present in lycopodium now urinary symptoms of sarsa perilla sarsa perilla is an excellent remedy for urinary troubles brought on or aggravated by abuse of mercury due to syphilis or gonorrhea the cardinal symptoms of this drugs are as follows there is severe unbearable pain at the conclusion of urine the urine is scanty slimy flaky sandy or occasionally bloody there is painful distension and tenderness in the bladder quite frequently there is passage of gravel or small calculi and white sand and urine or on diaper the urine dribbles while sitting passes freely while standing there is excruciating pain from the right kidney to downwards which is also present in lycopodium the child screams and cries before and during passing stools due to pain caused by passage of small stone which is also present in borax and lycopodium so if you like this drug do like and subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos and update thank you